Hey guys. I did something weird. What? I left work at 4 today. And I didn't get home till 7. What? <laughs> I stopped by the P.O. box. And then I, we stopped by Kristen's to play with Millie I and feed her. I keep let out the cat. But like, you don't let the cat out. You feed her and you play with her. And then uh, stopped by the bugs to say hey real quick. And I'm back home. Yeah. But traffic was crazy because I've never, Kristen lives further south than us on a busier road and uh, one I'm not used to. So, like, if I left at 4 o'clock and went to Kristen's, it would take me till 5.30 anyway. Oh. So, we thought we were going to go to Magic Kingdom tonight, but we're actually going to City Walk. Um, and hopefully Jill will actually come because Ooh. her passes are blocked out right now. I think we've explained it before. Jill became good friends with my brother in elementary school, probably mm -hmm. through junior high. Mm -hmm. And then they kind of like be, like went to different friend groups. Mm -hmm. And then Jill became friends with Jenna in high school. And then mm -hmm. they all became, friend, became friends together. Mm -hmm. So it was kind of some weird kind of So we would hang out of, with them. Yeah. And then Jill was the one that told us about the Disney College program. And, and then she moved down here so we would see her when we were on vacation we were on or vacation. we were working. And or... now we have our own friendship with her, but obviously Jenna's in town. They're yeah. gonna see each other. Yeah. So that'll work out nicely. Mama Mia posters at the movie theater. Mama Mia 2. Mama Mia 2, Strike Back of the Mama. What do you think? I said Mama Mia 2, Strike Back of the Mama. So we came like we did we most nights at City to. Walk. And uh, the park just closed, I think, because there is a ton of people here. A ton. Yeah. We've been here a while. We've been, been here since we got Voodoo Donuts, I think. Yeah, and, and like, we might get Voodoo tonight. During the week, like, did I get grass on or rain? Like, no, you did not get food done. Like, really, have we been here like when it's light out? Like, right, because we're. Oh, it's a mom and a crazy. Oh, on that Coke stand. Oh. Oh, man. So, like, we would yeah, definitely. Like, go to the movie at 10 30 on right. Thursday night. You know? First stop of the night. Oh, they're by Margaritaville? Never mind, we're not going here first stop. First stop is going by Margaritaville to meet Jenna and Bill. And look at this, they're doing some, uh, we knew this was closing though, right? I think Dom told me. Yeah. I don't know what it's becoming though. So the secret part about us that maybe could have shown that we were going to move here one day. <laughs> you know what you're going to say. Is I've always wanted a bunch of Margaritaville stuff in my house. So like it's just my vibe. My original vibe. I used to go to, I used to be a parent when I was a little kid. So I thought this was actually playable, but it's glued. It's 100% glued together. And Jill's here. You're 100% glued together. Everyone say congrats to Jill. She just got a scholarship for her for her masters. Comment down below. Yeah, she's gonna be she's gonna Vogue it up on Monday. Do a Vogue. Maybe we'll show it up. Ooh. <laughs> but I'm upset that this isn't real. <laughs> That's be fun thing play. Don't they have the? It's probably for sale. That's probably why it's out. Oh yeah, right there. Available, please ask team member. Ironic that I say it about this, but is it a trip to City Walk without a stop at Tusums? Black over here. Ooh, it's like a sea of delicious heaven. And over here, this is just nice and creepy. Get your nice macaroon, your nice creepy cerebrum skull. Um, they have their own coffee, Jacques. Jacques Coffee Concoctions. They have their own coffee, Jill. I thought it was popcorn. Oh, I didn't read. Sorry. Wait, I didn't read either. Is it popcorn or is it coffee? I just assumed. Oh! They're beans. You're a bean. <laughs> and they're different flavors. I like it. Let me know down below if you've had it. You would just eat them. Right. I mean, that's what. You're supposed to put them in like hot beverages. Isn't that really what you're supposed to do? Is really just eat them? No, they're for hot beverages and they. Oh. Like your neat honey one. You learn something new every day. Guess who's not going to 
like the Halloween Horror Nights this year. <laughs> Maybe this person. No, definitely that person. It's really not so scary. Yeah. <laughs> Catch us at Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. I'm gonna be a turtle. We're on the quest for something flamingo-y for Jill's co-worker. Nothing, nothing. I really thought this cutesy tootsy stuff would have it. Hmm. These are so cute. I could see there being a flamingo -y one, right? Close. But not a flamingo. So we're in line for Voodoo Donuts now, but they have this cool setup that we didn't see last time. They've got this cart which is packaged up of the 13, the 13 favorites. And so like you can't choose which ones you want. You can, I think if you get two or three of those, you get the coffin. So I think you get three of those and you get the coffin. But you get the 13 of the best. When they call you over from across the line, it is like the best feeling in the world. Ooh. We haven't been in here since the week that it opened. Nothing's really changed too much. Well, look, it's decorated all the way up there. Oh, stained glass. If that's real stained glass, props to you, Voodoo, because that is serious dedication. Sarah just tells me she thinks she's getting the Oh Captain, My Captain, which she got last time. I kind of want the Texas, but I kind of want the Fritter, but I kind of want the Maple Bar, and I kind of want the ODB, and I kind of want the Pulling Cream. Or that's the new, the new Universal Cream, I think. I don't know if it's new, so don't. Oh, it is. So we want to show you this photo because Peter and I actually recreated it for a college photography project of mine that I'll put in here. Um, just so classic, but so funny with those gnomes. I feel like that wasn't here last time. What did we get? What? what did we get? We got universal cream and something that you got. A triple chocolate. It's got cocoa puffs on it. Mine tastes like summer and fresh universal. What shenanigans are going on back there? I'm trying to take a video of this. Kind of a jip. What do you guys think? Kind of looks like a, a jip to me. Do you think mine's a jip? No, I think this is delicious. But it's mine. I had that one last time. That was good. You like Ooh, it? Oh, bursty balls are good. Yeah? Right. Yours is filled with cream. Same, same dance I did throughout my year. Did you get the Mafia? Mm, Memphis Mafia, the Voodoo Doll, and uh, the ODB. The moment, oh, the ODB I wanted to try. The moment I told Jenna this place is opening, she's like, you have to get the, ma the Mafia. So. Peanut butter, yeah, we got it. Something, chocolate, fritter. Delicious. I know I said my donut looked like a chip. It was a chip on the cereal, but it was worth it because the actual donut and the chocolate were super good. So I would get it if you like chocolate, but I did like my um, Captain, oh, Captain, my Captain, Captain Crunch vanilla donut better last time. Still good. Jenna because she doesn't like ET. Okay, Jill. Jill, you know I'm a Hufflepuff. Jill, you know I'm. It's a little cheesy. It is. <laughs> I wish it was a little cuter. She found. But I found it. I was determined. We found a flamingo. <laughs> okay, the necklace is a no go. Back to the montage. For the donut. It's too many sweets. I didn't help. Um, so yeah, we left Universal and now we are headed into Miller's Ale House. Keeping our fingers crossed the wait's not long. Yeah, I hope it's not. I mean, it's Thursday, but we'll see. Um, it's not like the, the college the program Miller's Ale House that we would go to with Dom. But it is the um, one across the street from Universal, so I could yeah. see it being a little busy. It was a good quick trip to the old Miller's Ale House. Hey, Look who showed up! James showed I didn't think you were gonna make it. I was nervous. <laughs> That's why I kept calling, because I was like, um, he said he's on his way, but I think he's just putting his shoes on. <laughs> well, we're good, now we're all going. 
So the night is coming to an end. But we're now far. Like we're usually not this far away from home. We're close to your home. Yeah. But we're far from my home. I don't like this. Usually it's the other way around. Okay, why don't you put both of your socks on first and then put your shoes on? Because the dog likes to bite my socks. <laughs> um, I mean, it's real late. It's like 12.40 in the morning. We're going to run because I signed up for the dopey today. So. Hooray! Cheering like, sound effects! It's a weird thing because I'm going to the American Cancer Society, so I'm raising money. So I have to raise $3,000 before the end of the year. I mean, we're gonna put the link the in link, the description. We'll a, a fancy videos explaining like yeah. why we're doing the run, all that good stuff. Society means to us. See, what, she loves socks. What my dog likes socks for. <laughs> so I'm gonna so, go. Yeah. Just, I'm gonna go put in two miles. I'll be back in like 17, 18 minutes. If I'm knowing that I'm gonna do two, I'm gonna try to push it. <laughs> Get back before one twenty. Have a cup of tea, a spot of tea. And then go to bed. It'll be interesting Eve when she knows someone else is here. And we're tomorrow, not going to bed. Maybe, tom maybe me and her will act like we're going to bed. Yeah, tomorrow we get another doggy. Yeah. Just we're for watching, a night. Just for we're a night. watching Dustin Katie's dog Padme. You've seen Padme before in the mm -hmm. vlogs. She's the so that'll be fine. other pound She's the other that they own. Hang on. So what am I going to do? 1.13 in the morning. Two miles in, but this is how humid it is. Like this is all sweat. It's real. Sorry, gross. But it's probably 85 degrees out there. Maybe closer to 90 with the humidity and how it feels. So that uh, that tre treadmill is looking mighty friendly. So we'll see how that goes tomorrow. I'm working from home, so I don't know when I'm gonna run. Either. I could either run right away in the morning. I don't have to really be online until 9 a.m. Um, or I might go in the evening. But if I go early, like right when I wake up, I might be able to run outside. It might cool off enough overnight, so. Two girls in there are about to fall asleep. Sarah just hollered, it's good to be home, and uh, it is, it's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.